Lord have mercy. You see that? Nothing but calories. <laughs> I got to do better, y'all. And ain't it open. I think. <laughs> chick trying to eat healthy and look at all this look at all this sugar sodium and all that <sighs> lord have mercy lord have mercy you see that nothing but calories <laughs> i got to do better y'all okay what's up y'all i'm finally back i ain't gonna say finally because you know i'll be taking breaks and then coming back and shit so it don't matter but um Yes, I'm trying to get back on my weight loss journey. It's been a struggle every day. It's like, what do I need to eat? What can I eat? I want this. I ain't about to deprive myself from it. It's just it's a lot of emotions going on. And as you can see, I had a number of junk food. <laughs> and I live with other people who, you know, they skinny and stuff like that. So they just want to eat what they want to eat. Talk to teach, teach it on, but I can say they are trying to help me lose weight. Um, my mom, she's trying to do, lose weight as well. But she got some other issues she need to take care of before she can really start her weight journey. And I will be on that with her. Kudos to us. We've been going through this. I've been going through weight loss, trying to lose weight since middle school. So I used to be, you know, a little small, petite little thing. And now I'm just done blowed up. It's like ever since I got married in a good relationship, shit just been going down. <laughs> As far as weight, I've been overeating, I've been stressed. It's just a lot. And I'm really trying to stay focused. You know, I watch other influencers that has went on their weight loss journey and they doing tremendously and stuff like that. But they were like, it's it's a lifestyle. You have to stay focused, you have to stay determined, you have to stay motivated. And I'm motivated is, I'm trying, I'm trying. And um. Like yesterday, I was uh, with my mom. She was getting her hair done. And I was just talking to my best friend, aka my sis. Hey, Danny. Um, I was just telling her, I don't know my purpose on this earth. Like, it's really depressing. Don't mind the washing machine because, you know, we got to wash clothes. Got to have so fresh and so clean, clean clothes. Can't be out here funky. Um, yeah, I was just telling her, I don't know my purpose. Like, I don't like i went to college i thought i wanted to be a counselor too much for me mentally i'm not there to help anybody else because <laughs> i'd be ready you know some of the people be stories people be telling me i'd be like i'd be ready to go but what they at what they at? but um yeah i uh got my associates in social work i still want to help people because i love to see people at their highest potential. You know, I'm just that friend and be like, yeah, you can do it. You, you know, I'm always that dependable. And then I think about my friendships that I used to have. Like, why did they stop being friends with me? Cause I'm a good ass friend, you know, I know I am. But maybe they was just there, there for that season, not supposed to be with me for a long time, you know. A lot of shit was just going on in my head of why I am at where I am and just, different relationships I was in and I was just like on the verge of like I was crying because everybody know I'm a sensitive chick yeah whatever but um I wore my emotions on my sleeve you know it's just that type of person I am I can't shake this shit like that's just who I am so a lot has just been going on with me mentally and I am going to a therapist to talk not my problems so if you need help and you don't have nobody to talk to, definitely get you a therapist if you can. It's better to talk to a stranger. They don't know you from a can of paint. They just they listen, you know, try to help you out how they can with their medical degree and you know, just stuff like that. So yeah. That's why I'm at in life. Still trying to do this YouTube thing and 
and that's a struggle because YouTube, ugh, that's a whole nother damn video for another damn day. Um, you know, marriage life, you got your problems with that, but I'm glad I married the person I did. It's just a lot. It's, it's just really a lot that's going on with me. And I'm 30 and I still just don't know what I want to do. And it was, um... My best friend, she was like, you know, maybe you should do this weight loss journey, you know, record yourself, stuff like that, help other people. Because when somebody see you doing it and they be like, damn, I didn't think I can do it now, I know I can, can't care from you. You know, like influencing, so we're not really influencing, encouraging, inspiring. You know, that's what I see myself doing, you know, because at the end of the day, I love to make people smile, I love to make people laugh. I love to be around, motivated about their business type people. That's just, who I want to surround myself with. I don't want to be in no drama and all that shit. I'm too old for that. Like, we already got enough of that going on within how the government runs shit and stuff like that. We always come get it, because you always make me come get it. Yeah, we all gonna let it go. <laughs> Come on, get it. 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 I need two weeks off. <laughs> like, I'm gonna stop at the door. And they ain't even open. Walmart has some cute shirts. I like the color. Savage. Hey, you dropped this. Kind of people are my kind of people. There's a lot of people who need this. Period. These are cute. I like the fearless shirt. Cute. I just got that dress for me and Bae. 